pregnant woman how you look? Do you want to get punched? Come on, everyone's waiting. And remember, there's an invisible wall between you and the guests, so... Circulate and serve, circulate and serve, but above all, respect the wall. Any questions? Scatter. Priscilla! Yes, sir, Mr. Esposito. Who's the new girl? She's my sister-in-law, Roxy. She's a real hard worker. You're gonna love her. Hmm, love isn't a word in my vocabulary. She better not screw up. Work. hard to work, huh? Eddie Mars is here. Yes, so? So, he's a huge music producer. I'm gonna give him our demo. You stay away from him. Word is, he's a total player. Okay, well, then you give it to him. Uh. Put it away. You want us to get fired? No, I want us to get famous. Come on, this could be our huge break. Yeah, right. That's really all you have to say about this. No. You go take off some of that makeup. You look like you've been making out with Ronald McDonald. I'll be right out. I said I'll be right out. I said I'll be right out. Dirty Mars. You discovered Las Salitas and the Jump Boys and the Screaming Mayas and you have five Grammy nominations and four gold records. Am I wearing boxers or briefs? Excuse me? Uh -huh. Well, I mean, I figured since you know so much about me, but I guess we'll just have to wait till our first date to find out. You have the wrong girl. Sorry. Make that a second date. <laughs> you are bad. Actually, I'm really good. Yeah. yeah. I know, right? Let's give it up for Pixie Kill. Yeah, yeah. Over here, Sienna. Yeah. Okay, 
again. Hey. Okay. Let's have it. Have what? Your demo. How'd you know? I'm a genius. At least that's what Rolling Stone said about me. Okay. Um, it's my brother's band, Los Santos. Los Santos. Yeah. And you're the lead singer. Yeah, how'd you know that? Because I'm a genius, remember? Yeah. Okay. Priscilla, where are you? Where is my ahi tuna girl? Roxy, isn't she out there? Oh, if I knew, I wouldn't be asking you. Go find her. Well, let's hear some. Do what? You want to sing? No? Yeah, why not? Um. Okay. <laughs> million times I've done this. I'm nearly there, then I get scared. <laughs> why are you stopping? That's really good. Keep going. Come on. All these inner voices make me crash or do or die. So how am I supposed to make it if I give in before I win? So God, hear me say this. Here's the first thing. Gotta go. Thanks, bye. Gotta go. Oh, it's for you. Yeah, bye. Oh, and I am recording my debut album. Speaking of hot, this is the Eddie Mars. He's my record producer. Eddie, can she sing? Can she sing? Look at me, Sierra. Just wait till you hear it. <laughs> One's the kind you take home to mama. One's the kind you take home tonight. I know I'm a little off today, but you can fix it. You know, that's why you have the little buttons. Okay, it's your job. These, these buttons here. Right. These little magic buttons, okay? Mm -hmm. Cool. Well, let's see what they can do. Yeah, okay. Here's your voice in Megatune 2.0. One's a kind you take home to mama. One's a kind you take home to die. Okay. Here's your voice in Megatune 4.0. The kind you take home to die. Uh -huh. Here is your voice in Ultra Megatune 10.0. Home to die. Ying, ying, yeah, 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 ying. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No. I got a reputation. I can't do this to my career. Eddie, honey, your last three albums, they, they tanked. You don't, you don't really have a career. Now, how can we make this one a hit? Well, we can sound like this. I have an idea. Why don't you go produce her album? Just see how many downloads she gets. My guess? Three. Oh, <gasps> just like your number of vlogs. Stop that. This girl's got nothing on you. You are Sienna Montez. Where's that no-name singer that you produced? You know, with that great voice. Where is she now? Cashier pet shop. I'm just saying, Eddie. If you really want a hit, you need a star. And I'm a star. So, you want to get back to work now? Okay, cool. <clears throat> Me too. Ying, yang, yeah, 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 ying, yang, yeah, yeah. One's a kind you take home to mama, one's a kind you take home tonight. Ying.
are good, uh, but I need to book a solo act. Well, thanks for wasting our time. Let's get out of here. Yeah, great. You rocked it, little girl. Yeah. I mean, have you thought about going solo? Me? No. Mm -mm. Um, but look, listen, if you didn't like that number, we have plenty of others. My brother is the most incredible writer. Hey, no, not Friday, not Saturday. Sunday, maybe. Huh. What are you doing? You're gonna damage the mic. Who cares? I'm breaking up the band. You promised me that we'd never quit. I was a kid when I made that promise. Come on. I don't care. I'm holding you to it. We have to keep going to keep Mom and Dad's dream alive. Frankie, please, come on. We've been at it for years. We're broke. Hey, keep it down. I'm trying to do business here. I'll be outside. I'd take you out to dinner. Hungry? Yeah, we are. Oh, this is my brother Frank. Oh, it's good. Eddie Mars. Yeah, I know who you are. So, uh, where are we going? Oh, a actually, I was, uh, I was hoping to take your sister to dinner. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna go. I'll be right back. You guys talk, okay? Or don't talk. No. So, uh, this dinner is it business or pleasure? You can do what you love, it's all the same, right? When you're taking out my sister, there better be a difference. Frank! I gotta talk to you! Now! Have her home by midnight. You got it, Chief. to this dinner. I'm half a Los Santos. Yeah, the ugly half. <laughs> yep. No, I don't like that guy. All right, make sure you don't discuss any business. Okay. Or, or anything personal. Okay. Just stick to religion and politics. Those are safe. Oh, and, and if you try anything, remember, you're special. Okay? Man. You're 18 and not pregnant. On this block, that makes you very special. <clears throat> now go! My mother was this awesome singer, and my dad was this insane guitarist. Really? Yeah. Oh, man. So that's what you need to tell them. Yeah, there must be. <laughs> they were actually about to record their first album before they um, died in a car accident. I'm really sorry about that. It's fine. And they're in a better place now. Well, I'm sure your parents are really proud of you and your brother. I mean, I think your band's got a lot of potential, Rox. Thank you. <laughs> you have a really incredible voice, Roxy. 
That really means a lot coming from you. You're Eddie Mars. <laughs> and you're one in a million. Listen, I've got a proposition for you, okay? And the thing is, I really love your voice. I mean, I love it. I was just hoping that maybe I can... Roxy! Hey, Roxy, come on, wait up. I thought you were gonna sign our band, not steal my voice. Listen, I promise you, the second we're done with Sienna's album, we'll do yours. That will take months. Like, my family is broke. We're about to be evicted. Well, then that's why you should do it. I mean, this is your big break. Singing for Sienna and not telling anyone about it. Great. Look, Some I'd, break. I'd only be using your voice to enhance Sienna's vocals. Singers do this kind of thing all the time. Oh, uh, yeah? Yeah. Not this singer. Roxy. You know what? Maybe you're right. Next year, you might find some big music producer who will discover you and your band. In the meantime, I gotta find another singer. What's up? What's wrong? Gloria, my building manager, she's a really big gossip. How much back rent do you owe? Three hundred dollars. I got you square. I can't take your money. I know what it's like to struggle, okay? I wasn't always on top. Take it. <sighs> it's it's five hundred and you needed three. I'll keep the rest. Buy yourself some shoes that fit. Payback, I swear. Nah, it's no worries. Oh, this girl sounds good. I like that. Some pipes on her. Anyway, <laughs> you ought to know. I just dream about you. Hmm? You're singing at the Staples Center. <laughs> yeah, the Staples Center parking lot. Great, actually. Um, Eddie said our band has a lot of potential. Great! Did you hear that? What else did he say? Wait, why, why are you upset? Did he try anything? No. I'm gonna go to bed. I'm just really tired. Wait, wait, tired from what? Right, something's wrong. I'm gonna go tired. No. She'll tell us about it later. talk to you. You swear you're going to produce Los Santos' album next, right? Yes. I meant it when I said I love your voice.
Records. It's got my name on it. Yeah, it does. You should. Because it's your expense account. <laughs> oh, my God. Wait until I tell Frank. Nah, uh, uh, uh. You just signed a confidentiality agreement. You can't tell anybody. Nobody? Listen to me, Roxy. There were a lot of careers writing on this, okay? Now you have to swear to me. You can't tell a soul. You're doing what? Shh. It's called enhancing. Wrong. Enhancing is a little more salt, a little more pepper, going like this when a hot guy walks in. They're stealing your voice. Yo, Eddie's gonna produce this on this album. He is? Yeah. That's fantastic. I know. Hey, Frank! Hold on, I'm on the phone. No, 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 he cannot know about this. Why not? I just told you I'd get sued. We could lose everything. I'm telling Frank. No, please, he is so uncool. He ruined everything. Well, maybe he should. What you're doing is wrong. Okay, Priscilla. I need you to take a good look around you. Is this the life you want for your unborn child? Oh, you're good. That was a Metro Lounge. We got the gig. <gasps> right, so what do you want to tell me? I love my baby daddy. Come on, dinner's ready. I know you. Ah, he tuna me swas. Excuse me? You're the waitress from the party. What are you doing here? I work here. Nick Martin. I'm, um, VP of New Talent Development. You are? Yeah. You're so young. Well, the term boy wonder does get thrown around. A lot. Well, I'm Roxy Santos. Nice to meet you. So, how many new artists are you developing right now? Oh, tons. Yeah, I got my fingers in a lot of pies. <laughs> so many pies, I need extra fingers. Hey! Welcome to Cayman. Hi. How you doing, gorgeous? Oh, you look amazing. Oh, thanks. You forgetting something? Oh, it's sugar. Um, I, I put it in two packs. Nicky boy, you know I like to put my own sugar in, don't you? Now yeah. Go give me another one. Pick up my dry clean while you're at it. Okay. Make it snappy. This is where the magic happens. You like it? I love it. Where are the musicians? Oh, they already laid down all their tracks. So it's just the two of us. That's right. Why are you scared? No. A little bit. Well, don't worry. I'll never do anything you don't want me to.
Wow, I am thoroughly impressed. Great job tonight. I mean, you killed that track. Well, my producer's a genius. Oh, come on, now you're gonna make me blush. You know, a lot of people in my building think that we're dating. <laughs> oh, yeah, is that right? Yeah, it's just stupid, huh? Nah, it's not stupid. So are we dating? Roxy, I'm not into the whole label thing. <laughs> Me either. <laughs> so what would you say we're doing exactly? We're recording an album. Huh. Okay, well then in that case, thank you for the ride. Hey now, don't be like that. It's like you said. Can't be with me. I'm a bad boy. And you're just a good little girl. Well, maybe that's why you want to date me. To help you find the good inside the bad. Mm, I don't know if you're gonna find it. Well, I can try. You do that. Nice. <laughs> I know the lipstick won't fix it, but I better put my game face on. I wish mascara could mask this until all the tears are gone. You're so talented. Mom, can you talk to Eddie? Alone, please. I had no idea you had such a terrific voice this whole time. I thought you were just had no talent like your Mom, father. Mom, do you want me to pay for your wedding or not? That reminds me. I have to call the caterer. You go do that. Did you hear that? Even my own mother thought it was my voice. Yeah. Well, guess what? It's not, okay? So don't even think about it. Well, if anybody should be thinking about it, too. I mean, my name plus her vocals equals the biggest hit of your career. No, forget it. Look, Sienna, the deal is we are only using her tracks to enhance your vocals. Okay? In the story. <laughs> oh, Eddie, Eddie, Eddie. What's so funny? You. You're falling in love with her, aren't you? What? It's okay if you are. And it's okay. Well, I'm not. Okay, so stop. Well, I'm glad. Because we both know that you can do so much better than that. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I thought we were done. Well, you tell me. I mean, are you done with this? Mm. I didn't think you were. Never thought it'd come with this. I'm stuck in up the shit. With the half of the perfect guy. Wrap him up and he's like, cut, cut, cut. Yo, what's up? You keep singing the wrong verse. Come on, let's take it from the top. Ready? No, no, I gotta go. My band has a gig. I'm late. All right. You just hate to miss out on that 10 bucks. It's not about the money. It's my brother. He threatened to disband the group. Oh, wouldn't that suck? Then I'd have no other choice but to make you into a solo artist. Solo artist? No, no. My brother and I made a promise. Come on, you can be the next one name wonder. 
Shakira, Rihanna, Roxana. <laughs> Roxana. Maya. You could go far, and I can help you get there. Just think about it, okay? top now let's do this five four three two ay, 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 ay. Canta y no llores porque cantando se alegra cielito lindo los corazones here's your feet Hey, this this is only half. For your half-ass performance. You ruined the happiest day of my daughter's life. Live with that. Guys, 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 guys. I am so sorry I'm late. There was a... My bus... My bus broke down. Third time this week? Yeah, you know, you think, I don't know, you take a different bus. Yeah, or maybe just think of a different excuse that's insulting. Come on, be creative. There's a whole plethora of lies you can choose from. And you blow us off again your history. Well, you can't fire me. I'm the lead singer. You're the lead screw-up. I really don't appreciate you talking to me like that in front of my band. You hear that, Troy? Now we're in her band. Oh, mm. Sweet. We're out of here. What was going on between you and that heavy guy, huh? Been showing up later every night. Is that what you think? Ever since you started hanging out with him, I can't count on you for Jack. But I'm doing it for us. I'm doing it for our band. Hey, don't put this on me, okay? You're messing up your life. Like, I thought I raised you better than that. I told you, it is not what you think. Yeah, yeah right. Yeah. If you keep this up, you're gonna end up broke, knocked up, and living with some loser. You mean like Priscilla? Frankie, I am so sorry. I didn't... not doing anything we rehearsed. I know. Oh, okay. Then you keep doing whatever it is you're doing. I gotta talk to you. I am rehearsing. Now! You stole her tracks. But you gave them to me. Only to use as a reference. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought the other night when we, you know. It's not your voice. She only agreed to enhancing. Ugh, you keep talking about that girl. Do you have any idea what that does to my self-esteem? Are you out of your mind? If this gets out, the press will be all over us. They already are. Joseph! Joseph, come here. This is Joseph. He's doing my cover story for Music Weekly. Joseph, this is the Eddie Mars. Oh, hot track, Mars. Thanks. Someone's going to number one. <gasps> oh, let's take some pictures. No, okay. Did you hear that? You're going to number one. And after three flops, he means it's just in time. Oh, let's go. We have a 10 o'clock curtain. Do it exactly as we rehearse. Except for you, Miss Montez. You do whatever you want. Oh, no. I'll do whatever you want. Now smile. All right, that's enough. Oh, one more. Yeah. <laughs>
survived. So, uh, how's the album coming along? What are you talking about? Come on. The one that you and Eddie have been working on the last few weeks. What else could you be doing? How old are you? Five? Jeez. Nah. No, it can't be that. Eddie tires of girls after a couple of days. Well, maybe he hasn't met the right girl yet. Yeah, maybe. But I doubt if it's you. Eddie likes some flashy, lots of bling, you know, like Sienna Montez. Wait, are Sienna and Eddie dating? No, oh, I didn't say that. No, that's just gossip, which is less veracity than a rumor. Just code for idle talk. Ugh. Hey, Roxy, wait up. Uh, where was I? I don't know. You lost me at veracity. I'm sorry. I tend to talk too much when I'm about to, um, do you want to go out with me tonight? No, I'm good. Come on, it's this real cool invitation-only event at the Plush Club, only 50 VIP guests. How did you score that? That's a tough. Head of sales, give me his tickets. We go way back. Oh, yeah? I babysit his kids. That's what I figured. Will Eddie be there? Yeah, yeah, he'll be there, along with all the other big shots. Well, what time's the event at? It's at 8 o'clock. What's your address? I'll pick you up. I'll meet you there at 9. OK, Roxy. Play hard to get. I get it. I'm not playing. Right. It's cool. OK. And it's Roxana. Mm -hmm. Roxana? Where'd that come from? What do you think? Lady, I think you got the wrong apartment. That's all you have to say? Recording an album for Sina Montes? You swore you wouldn't tell him. I had to. He's been driving me crazy. He thinks you're being taken advantage of. And you are. So you signed with a label. You didn't tell me? Well, why should I? You were gonna break up the band. You didn't think we were good enough. Yeah, and you thought you were so good that you gave away your voice? No, I am just enhancing Sienna's vocals. Right. Who's into your vocals? Huh? Bet you didn't think about that. Eddie will figure it out. You really think that scumbag cares about you? Don't call him that. He's the only person who's ever believed in me. Yeah? And yeah, what about the guy who helped you get over your stage fright? Put a microphone in your hand and told you you can do it. That doesn't count. You're my brother. Right. And now you don't need me because you got this guy telling you everything you want to hear. He's going to produce our next album. Yeah, right. Look, count me out. OK. You're out. I hope that outfit came with a matching suitcase. So I want you out of here. Traitor. Homeless. <laughs>
So, uh, how long have you been Eddie's assistant? I'm not Eddie's assistant. Oh. I'm his intern. Not for long. I started my own label. Oh, well, that's very ambitious of you. <sighs> yeah, you should, uh, you should stop by the studio sometime. You have a studio? That's really cool. Actually, it's my friend Rudy's garage. Ah, uh, that's not so cool. Um, <laughs> but it'll do for now. Okay. One day, my label, Big Bad Love Records, is gonna be a major player. Big Bad Love Records? And chicks love it. Oh, do they? Mm -hmm. So, why isn't your girlfriend here? Who says she isn't? you get my track? Eddie gave it to me, among other things. You're a liar. Eddie told me I was just enhancing your vocals. Oh, well, you know, boys. And they'll say whatever they have to say to get these homeless girls. Oh, let me guess. He promised you a record deal, and you actually believed him. Why wouldn't I? I can make you a recording star. Imagine what he can do with me. Oh, sweetie, I know exactly what he's going to do with you. I'm going to tell the world about this. Oh, go right ahead. No one's gonna believe you. You're a drunk. I am not a drunk! Oh, you wanna bet. <gasps> Help! Help! She's attacking me! She's threatening me! Help me! Oh, you you, so you got to be kidding me! This is a joke! Oh, oh my god! I was trying to do it just reason with her, and then she just, she just came me. after me! Please, she stole my voice! She said, Dave, please come on the cops or something! Please! Eddie, Eddie, I was 
so scared. I could have died, right? You okay. guys don't just okay. hold Ross me. Just hold me. So what happened? Look, I don't know what happened. One minute I'm just sitting here talking about our sobriety, and the next, wait, Eddie, who is this guy? He's my intern. Why am I talking to you? Ugh. Go bail her out, and don't let her out of your sight. What's going on? You want to keep your job? Do what I tell you to do. Go. I may need you to testify in court. Anything you need, anything, right, guys? What are you waiting for? Well, thanks for bailing me out. Anytime. Well, not anytime, because I never want to bail you out again, but what I meant to say was... Um, you're welcome. Yeah. Okay, good night. Good night. Oh, uh, wait. I'm so sorry. Aren't you supposed to be at some big industry party? You'll never guess what happened. No, me. I probably wouldn't. Me neither. Are you hungry? Um, starved. Come on, I fix you a plate. Uh, you like a hot dog? Yes, um, maybe. Can I get mine rare? What time is your first all tomorrow? Noon. Okay, I'll be there. Hey, listen. I talk to the guys, you know. Frank, come on, you can't break up the band. Come on. I decided that after tomorrow's show, you're out. Fire. What? Roxy, why is everybody mad at you? Nobody's mad at me, Paloma. Here's a burger. Mmm, well done. Just like I like it. Paloma! This has been quite a night. You were tied to a celebrity. You got thrown in jail. Got fired from your band. What do you do for an encore? Who knows? Night's still young. Roxy, nobody stole your voice. Me. Listen, nowadays, producers can make anybody sound like anyone else. I hear it all the time. A million times I've done this, and then you leave it, and I get scared. Oh, God, hear me say this. This defeat is wearing <gasps> Are you kidding me? It's Eddie. I said to meet him at Cambridge tomorrow at 10 a.m. He's gonna fix everything. Yeah, sure he is. I've been waiting for almost two hours. I have to be somewhere in 15 minutes. Do you know how much longer it's gonna be? We'll see you now, Miss Santos. I never signed this. All I signed was a two-page deal memo that references this 200-page document. 
It is my voice. Ask Eddie Mars. Ask him yourself. <sighs> Thank God you're here. Please, go ahead and tell him the truth. Miss Santos did some backup vocals for Miss Montez. What? No, that is not true. I recorded the whole album. It is my voice. Are we through here? Thanks. <sighs> Eddie, please, One wait. Moment. How do you plan to pay back the $27,000 that you owe us? $27,000? For what? Your Cayman credit card. And we also need to discuss your restraining order. You're not only forbidden to be within 100 feet of Sienna Montez, but also from purchasing any of her product lines, including Sienna's acne fighting system and Sienna wear. Eddie! 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 How could you do this to me? For an album? Not just an album, Roxy. A hit album. Can you please call Nick Martin again? I really need to talk to you. No, no, no I, I don't. Please, I, don't know I need this your girl. help. So, uh, don't but, know me. But, but, don't know me. But, you don't know I'll, me. I'll take care of it. Are though. you it's kidding okay. me? I'll take... Do you understand I'll... what they're trying to do to me? I'm gonna do a coffee run. Okay, you want a coffee? Doing. Don't worry about it. It's okay. I'm gonna post it on Twitter, Facebook it, YouTube it, tweet it. Great. Okay, great. Yeah, that, and then Cayman will sue you for slander. <laughs> so what am I supposed to do? Roxy, I like you. But this is turning into Sienna Gate. I'm not even supposed to be talking to you. So what's that mean? You're not gonna help me? I can't. I'll be risking my career. You are an intern. I'm a paid intern. Okay. You keep your cuticle. I'll figure it out myself. Freddie Franco just confirmed for tonight. Oh my God, he's a legend. How'd you pull that off? I just promised him he'd be hearing the best new artist of the year. <sighs> now I'm really nervous. Um, I better go tell the guys. I'm sorry if I was ever mean to you. Uh, don't remind me. I can still call this whole thing off. No, you won't. You're right, I won't. <laughs> Yvette? What are you doing here? I was just about to ask you the same thing. Amateur Nights Monday. Ha <laughs> ha cute. Maybe you should come back for comedy night. Work on your joke of a career. Hey, Yvette. Hey. Arr. <laughs> what is going on? Girl, do I have to spill it out for you? Come on, let's go. Let's go. Yeah. No, what is going on? Somebody's been replaced because somebody missed rehearsals again. I texted you so many times. I told you I had an emergency. Yeah, well, I also had an emergency. You left me without a singer. Enter Yvette. Yeah, yeah. Boom goes the dynamite. That's right. Okay, yeah. Which I'll call you back in five. All right. Freddy Franco, my name's Nick Martin. Great. Uh, Scotch neat. Okay. Nick, where's uh, the next Rihanna? She's up next. She better be. This place smells like cat piss. Oh! Eduardo! Franco! What's up, brother? What's up, brother? What's the business, playboy? Same old, same old. Looking good. Looking likewise, sweet. Likewise, likewise. Hey, hang on once. I got to call this guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do your thing. 
You invite Freddy Franco to this, and not me? That's because you've heard this group before. Los Santos. I know you know the lead singer, Roxy. Tell me you're joking. Guys, please, I am so sorry. Yeah, I bet you are. Don't want to hear it. Look, buddy, we'll be outside. I have to go on tonight. You know I can sing circles around Yvette. Excuse me. Yvette is right here. There are so many important people in the audience. Please. Important? How important? Who are you? Huh? You used to care about the group. Now, now it's all about your moods, your schedule, your, your singing career. What, what is it with you, huh? Oh, no, please, Frankie. I'm sorry. I will make it up to you. I promise. I'm begging. Oh, no, you won't. You're not gonna let her go on after all she's done to you. Yvette, shut up! Frankie, please. I have to sing tonight, please. I have to prove to them that it's my voice. I See, have... it's all about yourself. That's all you care about. No, that's not true, please, for Los Santos. Yeah, I thought we were. Let's go. See me, Jefe. Bad sister. Please, Yvette, you have to help me. I'm begging you. I have to go out there tonight. I, I have to prove to them it's my voice, please. Okay, fine. But you have to go freshen up because you are a hot mess. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. You're an angel. Thank you. our time here. Let's go to a oh, real club. Let's get out of here. I, I guarantee you're going to love this girl. Guarantee. You guarantee me? Absolutely. All right. Show me the magic. Eddie got to you, didn't he? What? 
Why didn't you go on stage? He fed you one of his lines, and you bought it. No, Again. that's not true. I just lost my job because of you. I fired you? Yeah. I would have fired myself after hearing that girl sing. Hey, that girl is right here. Hey, too, Roxy. You ruined my big break. And I never want to see you again, ever. Nick, wait! Here, Kim Gomez just bought your Chanel dress. Great. Another ten bucks for Cayman. Girl, you're getting ripped off. Everybody thinks they're fakes. Well, because a big fake is selling them. Now, I say we move the store to Beverly Hills. At least those hoochies won't think they're knockoffs. You're gonna help me? What do you think? You sure you don't want to hang on to any of this? They're not me anymore. Well, I'm glad. How much is this? Well, I paid a thousand for it, but you can have it for a hug. Deal. <laughs> Look, Paloma. Remember that a designer bag isn't gonna make you feel happier or more beautiful or feel better inside. It's just... Roxy, I just need a backpack. Oh. De los comienzo de la na. Frankie, Frankie, please. Frankie, Frankie. Frankie, Frankie, please stop. Please. I'm sorry. I don't blame you for hating me. anything, I hate me. You are a big break. No, no, it's fine. We can start over. Got a new demo. We'll split up the group. You can't do that. Remember, we're Los Santos. Nobody can split us up. And nobody will. You're my sister. you always be my sister. But I'm a married man. I have a kid on the way. You can't give up. For us, for mom and dad. You know, they were so close to making it. No. No, they weren't. Roxy. They died on their way to Hawk Mama's wedding ring. They weren't even close. you lie to me? So that you grow up with hope. Not hating the world like I did. 
I'm sorry. I just wanted to protect you. Maybe now that you know, we can both move on. Stop pretending like we ever even had a chance. I, I gotta go. Yo, whoever's out there, give me some coffee. Sugar on the side. You mean the other one that you didn't sing? Well, somebody's a grump today. <sighs> but I know it'll cheer you right up. A Christmas album. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. How are you gonna get to sing that one? Oh, well, just use what's her name. I mean, she's under contract. You know, Sienna, she can cause us some real trouble. I know, and that's exactly why I'm having her investigated. Just in case he tries to play dirty. I'll have some dirt on her, too. You got this all figured out, don't you? Well, I have to. I mean, do you know how many nuts are out there saying that I stole their products? Their finish lines, their fragrances, nail polish, shoes, flowers, hairline. Nick, you got a minute? I got all day. I'm unemployed. How can I make it up to you? Stay away. You're not giving up that easily, are you? Come on. There's something I want to talk to you about. Montez received the Entrepreneur of the Year Award and maybe perform a song from her latest venture, her debut album. For Star Tracks, this is Giselle Gutierrez. Okay, boys and girls, you are my servers. And as my servers, there's a wall between you and them. Got it? So you circulate and serve, circulate and serve. But above all, respect the wall. Yes, very nice. Get to work. I'm so grateful for this award. I just, I cannot believe that this is happening to me. I mean, I am just a little farm girl from Fresno. Oh, and do not forget to go check out my new album, One Voice. It comes out in two weeks, and I could not have done it without this man right here. This is Mr. Eddie Mars, everybody. Mm, I just love him. And oh, very, very exciting news, everybody. I am starting my new venture. Ready? I'm going to be directing my first film. And I, yeah. I actually will be sorry. You sure you want to do this? Good, because I just notified the press. Tell me you're ready. Show started. Welcome to the world of Sienna products. Whether dancing in a club or walking the red carpet, Sienna Ware's got your perfect outfit. You'll be dressed just right from morning till night. Learn Spanish the easy way with CC con Siena. Don't do so the camera. Mark your entrance with her signature perfume, Scent of Siena. Mmm, smell like a winner. You can't just go out there and sing. This isn't one of your dumpy grunge bars. This is the only chance that I have. But your brother's not here. It'll be just you, alone, on stage, making a fool of yourself. Priscilla, where are you? Girl, you better bring it, because our catering careers are so over.
scare you? Why are you shaking? I'm gonna prove it's my voice. Oh. Nobody cares if it's your voice. It's me they want. I mean, I am the one with the money and the fame and the power. Yeah, all that's missing is the talent. Well, that's what you're for. I won't do it. You don't have a choice. You already signed a contract for life. I mean, besides, being my voice was the greatest thing that ever happened to you. If you really think about it, without me, you're nobody. <laughs> you are really so lucky. You get to be my voice. Gosh, what more could you want? Chihuahuas with her latest and greatest product, her voice. Give it up for Sienna Montez. Hey, everybody. How y'all doing tonight? Thanks so much for coming out, you guys. you the best. I love my fans. How are the people on the balcony up there? You guys are great. A voice. <clears throat> testing, testing, <clears throat> testing. <clears throat> hey, let's go. They're playing the blank track I gave them. It was wrong. I don't know what I was thinking. I can't do this. Rossi. Do you see that girl? Hmm? She's a major talent. Because her parents were talented. And that gift they had? They gave it to you. Now's your time to share it with the world. No, you're right. I should do this for them. Not just for them. You gotta do it for you. We seem to be having some technical difficulties, everybody. But don't you worry. We will get it fixed any minute now. But you are all looking fabulous tonight. Woo! Oh, good. I, I think we're back on now, everybody. I think we have the problem fixed. A million times I've done this. I'm nearly there, then I get scared. All these inner voices make me crash it do or die. So how am I supposed to make it if I give in before I win? Oh, I'm gonna God, have to promise just, just, just one minute. Cause defeat is wearing thin. But I've gotta wipe these tears away. And put my big Audio. pen Audio. on. Audio. Cause there's no more next time. Are you stupid? Of course I am. In that case, you're being served. Tonight is the night. I'm finally ready to ride this. I gotta fly before I fall. No more making up excuses. I'm gonna win the fight. Copyright infringement, plagiarism, <laughs> and theft. It. She got some. Get out Hey, Sienna, 
Hannah, what's the story? Is it true that you've been stealing other people's ideas? Oh, it's not lies. How about stealing another singer's voice for your debut album? It's lies, okay? I'm an artist. Oh, where's Priscilla? Ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up to Cayman Records' newest recording star, Roxy Santos. Aging Roxy Santos. Oh, not again. Can't be disappearing on me like that. The media's going crazy. They aired your performance live. Everybody wants to know who you are. Roxy Santos. And that's the new name of Sienna's old album. And don't worry about the contract, okay? It's null and void. Good. Then I can be through with you. What? Don't say that. So we made some mistakes, right? We just make up and move forward. I am moving forward. Away from you. <laughs> Rox, come on, don't play like that. Look, it's like you said. I need you in my life. <laughs> Find the good inside the bad. Hmm. I think you're a little too late for that. Roxy, hey. Huh. What's he doing here? How's Maya? She's beautiful. Oh, I'm not surprised. Come on, let's go celebrate. Eddie! You're not invited. <laughs> Where are you going? Hey, come on, Rolling Stone, E.T., TMZ, they all want to talk to you. Hmm. Well, then you should probably direct them to my new producer. Nick? Nick's not a producer, he's my intern. Guy gets me coffee. Not anymore. You're making a mistake. Going with Nick? You gonna come back, Rox? I'm Eddie Mars, Cayman Records. Yeah, you got my phone number. I'm really sorry for running out on you again. Yeah, you keep doing that. I'm gonna start taking you personally. <laughs> I'm really sorry. It'll never happen. You need to slow down a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, especially now that we'll be working together. Right. Yeah, I should really never make some business with pleasure again. Yeah. It never works out. Too good.